want to introduce Gwyn, my good friend from Minnesota. Gwyn is both a patient of mine or a client as well as a student. Uh, she finished the first part of my course, segment A and B, and she is a very dedicated student in our method to her work. Gwyn, uh, one of my points of admiration to you is that you have progressive muscular dystrophy in your family that your two sisters are afflicted with the same problem you are. Mm -hmm. But there's a big difference between you and your sisters, isn't there? Mm -hmm. One sister, I understand, succumbed to her problem. The other one didn't until the psychologist convinced her to succumb to her problem. And you decided to fight and to be on your feet until a very old age, right? Correct. Yeah, right. And I want to help Gwen do her work. Beside my work, Queen is watching her diet most of the time. Mm -hmm. uh, she's a human being. She can't watch it all of the time, right? Uh, and beside my work, and that's important because losing weight and not being overly, um, and not having a belly like I have, is a very important thing for everyone. But for muscular dystrophy, it means less pressure on the legs. Mm -hmm. In muscular dystrophy, the muscles get destroyed by the disease, but we can build up fibers that have never gotten destroyed. We can increase the numbers of actin and myosins, which are the contractile elements within each muscle fiber. Uh, Gwyn had some improvement, some regression since we started to work, and I would say 70% improvement and 30% regression. Basically, she is ahead of where she was. And she did a very, very good work on herself. We will have some massage techniques that we will show now in support of her work on herself. So, while we paid attention to Gwyn's body, we also have to pay attention to Gwyn's face. For example, Gwyn, try to smile. Or puff your cheeks. Those are tough things to do. She's doing an exercise on a daily basis. Can you show everyone the exercise? Very good. It's a great exercise for her lips and for her face. And to support her work on herself, I massage the cheeks. I may massage the cheeks one by one. And in rotating motion. Does this feel good? Mm -hmm. And I can do slight impingement and tapping, but very gentle. And I keep massaging the face, the eyes, the forehead, but especially the face in different areas of the face. We can sometimes use cream, we don't have to. Puff your cheeks right now. Yeah, a little bit more under my fingers. Will be more in the future. 